This is a story of how Min and Mu and Malik went on an adventure. They lived in a big house with a green door and one day they decided to go on an adventure. Oh, let's go and see if we can find a bear, said Ming, who was very fond of large, fluffy animals. And Mu said, I want to come. And Malik said, well, I've got my stick, so let's go. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to find a big one. We're not scared. What a beautiful day. And off they went. Oh, look, swishy, swashy grass. We can't go over it because he wasn't a bird. He was a pussycat. We can't go under it, said Moo, because she wasn't a worm. She was a cow. We'll have to go through it, said Malik. Let's go. Swishy, swashy, swishy, swashy. Moo, I like grass, said Moo, and ate some, and a poppy too. Mmm, mmm. Ming didn't like it quite so much. I was not fond of it, but she could sneak in between the tall grasses and pretend she was a tiger, and she liked that. Moo, said Moo, and I'm coming, said Malik, and they came to the edge of a river. Oh no, said Ming, it's a river. We can't go. I can't swim. I don't even like getting wet. We can't go under it. Oh no, we can't go over it, said Moo, because she wasn't a bird. She couldn't fly. We'll have to walk go through it, said Malik. And off they went. Oh no, said Ming, I don't like getting wet. I'm a cat. Well, hang on, said Moo. You can sit on my back, because I like mud and water. And off they went. Splishy, splashy. Oh, mind my tail, said Ming, and held it up high by her ears. Could be a he. It was before. Splashy, splishy, splashy, splishy, splashy, splishy, splashy. Off! And off jumped Ming. I'm going! Splish, splash, splish, splash. He actually went for a quick swim. And landed on the other side. And what was on the other side? Ooh, mud, said Ming, who didn't like getting her paws muddy any more than she liked getting wet. Oh, mud, said Moo. I quite like mud. Not too much, but a bit it's good sometimes. Oh, I like mud too, said Malik. We can't go over it, said Ming. We can't go under it, said Moo. But we could go through it. Let's go through it. And off they went. What did they say? Squish, squelch, squirt, squelch. <coughs> Oh, it's good, they all said. Oh, and then they remembered. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Mm, I'm not sure. Oh, look, said Ming. It's a forest. A dark, tricky forest with shadows. A bit scary, said Moo, and not a lot of grass. <gasps> I like an adventure. Full of sticks it is, the woods of a forest, and I've got a stick. Maybe I'll find another, even better stick, said Malik. And off they went. We can't go over it, because she wasn't a bird. We can't go under it, because she wasn't a worm. We'll have to go through it, said Malik. And off they went. We're going on a bear hunt. Mm, stumble, trip, stumble, trip. It was dark in the forest. Oh, stumble, trip. Oh, oh, hold my hand, me. I haven't got any hands, said me. No, man. Hold on tight. Come close. Moo. Meow. Moo. Meow. Moo, said Malik. Oh, look. It's snow, said Ming. I've read about snow. Oh, look. Whoa, it's cold. Ice and snow and crystals. Who said, no, I've never seen snow. It looks very cold. Well, we're going on a bear hunt, so we're going to have to go, but we can't go over it, said Ming, because she wasn't a bird. We can't go under it, said Moo, because he wasn't a cow. I mean, she was a cow, but she wasn't a worm. We'll have to go through it, said Malik, who liked adventure. And so they did. And it was cold. The wind blew. Woo, woo. 
<gasps> and the snow hit them in the faces. Meow, meow, said Ming, because the snow melted under her warm little paws and it was cold. Meow, quick, let's go to the other side. We can't go under it, no, we're going to be warm. Woof, here we are, we're on the other side. Come on, Ming, get through that snow. Okay, here I come, Mike, said. I didn't get another stick, never mind. Next time we go on an adventure. And Ming and Mu and Malik had gone a long way from home and they were by the sea. There was the beach and the waves crashing on the shore. You never see that in the book, do you? But it's there. And they still hadn't found a bear. But then, oh no, what's that? It's a cave. <gasps> oh, let's go in there. <gasps> Are you sure? said Ming. Are you sure? said Mu. Let's go, said Malik. Let's go. And in they went. Tiptoe, 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 tiptoe. <gasps> What's that? Oh, one big shiny nose, two googly eyes. It was a Something else as well. It was a bear. Oh no. It was eating a fish. Oh, said Ming. I like fish. Maybe we could be friends. But the others said, no, no. Quick. We need to run. We need to run. And run is what they did. Out of the cave. Tiptoe. No, they didn't tiptoe. They ran. And through the snow. Woo, 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 woo. And the bear came after them, bringing his fish. Quick, quick, through the forest. Stumble, trip, stumble, trip. Come on, Ming. Come on, Moo. Mmm, said the bear, and followed them. <gasps> Into the muddy bed. Oh, no, my paws, my paws, my beautiful clean fur, said Ming. <laughs> said the bear and followed them <gasps> to the river splash 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 <laughs> said the bear and went through the mud <gasps> no and through the river they went splish splash splish splash splish splash back to the grass and the bear came through the river too splish splash splish splash splishy splashy splishy splashy swishy, swishy. quick 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 let's go home it's got a fish, said me. Come on, said the other two. And they got all the way to their house with a big green door. And they got in and they ran up the stairs. Quick, come on, come on, come on, come on. And they closed it up and they got to the top of the stairs and they thought, oh no, we forgot to lock the door. And then came the bear. Ming was very quick. She ran back down, locked the door and ran back up and they all got into bed and hid underneath a great big pink duvet and the bear came to the door and looked through the door and thought oh, I like that little cat I would have shared my fish oh, he couldn't get in because the door was locked and so he went home oh, he was sad he wanted a friend Oh, he looked back at the house and he called out and said, oh, you can't see him, I'll move the thing, hold on. I'll share my fish. And at that moment, who should come running out the door? But Ming, running, coming, I'll be your friend, I'll be your friend. I'll share your fish. Can you give me a lift across the river? Sure can, said the bear. And so Ming climbed on the bear's big furry back and they became very good friends and played together lots. Of course Ming didn't stay and live with the bear because she lived with Malik and Mu. But that's another story. Of the door and their garden and the butterfly and the little path and the poppies and the grass and all the different fabrics and the river and the mud and the forest with the trees and the stones and the snow and the ice and the wind 
in a makeshift cave and my fish-eating bear. <laughs>